Remember, in order for us to continue to bring you these great videos, it is critical that you share, like, and definitely subscribe to the channel. Today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to set up your rear hand by using your jab and changing speeds and the trajectory of the jab to set up the rear hand. So what we're doing, it's all about rhythm changes and speed changes, tempo changes. He's gonna throw two full jabs at me, I'm boxing him, okay? And, he, and I'm, let's say I'm catching that jab, right? One, two. Now you see he threw two full jabs. He's throwing a jab out, he's throwing a jab back, right, okay? Now I'm getting, in my mind, I'm getting the rhythm of that jab. So I'm gonna learn how to deal with that jab under that rhythm. So what he's gonna do the next time, so what he's doing is he's throwing two full jabs. Okay, now the second time what he does is he throws a full jab and then he's gonna, that's right, and he's not gonna bring his hand all the way back and then he's going to change trajectory and his head movement that's right. And then he's going to throw this punch under. The fist is going to be under. So it's going to give me the visual of picking my head up and pushing my head to my left and his right where he can throw the right hand and push me right into the right hand. See? Picking me up and over into the right hand. So he is, he is changing the trajectory of his jab. He's giving me a different look and he's also shooting from a little bit different of an angle and he's changing the rhythms with it. So he's throwing two full jabs, boom, boom. Then he's throwing one jab, and that's what he's doing, okay? And I see him go that way. When I see him go this way, that could be my reaction. It could be up and over. And then he's there to throw the right hand, okay? So that's what he's trying to do right there. He's going two jabs at a regular speed, boom, boom. And then he's going boom, that's it, see? And that jab could land Let's say I'm throwing, just to show you the science of it, let's say he's throwing that jab and I'm catching it here. I'm catching it here. Then when he throws that one there and he takes that angle, my hand's there, he could shoot it. He could shoot it right underneath the air to throw the right hand, see? Or he could throw it. That's what a fighter does. A fighter finds his spot. A fighter finds his opening, okay? A really good fighter finds his opening. That's one way. The other way is he throws the jab. Boom, boom. Now he throws a one. Now he goes there, and I, let's say I'm here. That's right, it can go here. If I, if I have it up here, he could sneak it under. If I have it here, he could sneak it this way. If he sneaks it this way, he's really picking me up and over and pushing me into the right hand. So that's a more ideal, a more ideal angle, but they'll both work to land that rear hand. So go slow, we're throwing a jab. We're throwing a jab, go slow. So the rhythm is, you're throwing a jab, you're throwing a jab, full jabs. Then a full jab, and then halfway out, that's right. See what he did, boom. And my hand was catching here, right? So the first two jabs, I'm catching here, catching here, catching here, and then hit, that's it. See, and even if he doesn't throw it hard, doesn't matter, he's putting it right here to push me into the right hand, okay? So he's going one more time. She's going jab, 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 change the speed, boom, boom, right. Go slow, we're going jab, jab, jab. I'm catching, he doesn't, see he brought it back here. Don't bring it all the way back, okay? So this is something that you don't have to bring all the way back either. Now what he did, he could do that, but that's not the move we're showing you today. Showing about just bringing it, when you throw it, you take the angle, you don't bring it all the way back. You already are able to be able to touch the guy when he's touching it. So now you don't want to give him time because you're changing speeds with it. So you're going, you're going full jab, full jab, full jab, half, boom, right there like that. Because you already touched my hand. Mm -hmm. So now you just bring it, just that's it, right there and shoot it there to hit me with the right hand. See, that's the key. It's not bringing it all the way back. So it's, it's a speed change, okay? So he's going, he's going one, two, three, right there, boom. My reaction could be where I'm coming here. One, two, three. See that? See what I just did there? I went to catch it. I thought it was coming straight down the middle again. He threw it from this angle. Look where my head, boom. OK, 
Okay, one more time when he's going, he's going, he's going one, two, three. I'm looking for the parry again. Now I'm looking for the parry and he's coming right over top. And now I'm there to get hit with the right hand, okay? So that's just a real little sneaky move you guys can work on. And the way it's gonna look on the mitts is he's throwing two jabs, full jabs, one, boom, boom, that's it. So he's going slow, one, two, one, that's it. Don't even bring it all the way back. So you go one, two, one, that's it, like that. Jab, 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 pop out, that's it. Don't bring the left hand all the way back. One, two, jab, pop out, there you go, like that. Jab, 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 pop out, there you go. Speed change. Do it again, so your full jabs. One, two, one, ha, ha, there it is, like that. Step it back. So you're going one, two, five, ha, ha, there we go. So you're going one, two, one, ha, ha, good. One, two, one, ha, ha, good. Good work, step back. Full jabs, one, two, full jab, there you go. One, two, four, there it was, beautiful. So that's something you guys could take into the gym, work on. Those little fine details, man. Great, greatness is in the details. So that's something right there, you gotta master it. You know, the way he's throwing that, like I said, he's throwing that jab at one speed, then he's changing speeds with it, trajectory, angle. There's a lot of little things going on. He's coming, throwing it from a different angle, a different hand position, so a different trajectory. He's also changing speeds with it. And all those little things right there is what you have to be able to do when you're fighting experienced guys. Those things have, you can't just throw the basic speed jab, the same jab, the same rhythm all the time. And you can't throw it from the same angle all the time. So you have to continue to mix it up. And that's one way to, to work on uh, in the gym. And when you're sparring, try it. And uh, follow me on Instagram at Tommy and Kello Boxing for other uh, boxing related stuff. And uh, like, share, and subscribe. I'm getting ready to uh, surpass 100,000 followers. And I want to say thank you to all you guys that have really been supporting me over the last two years. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.